All right, so I just got a new Studio Trends uh, sidecar rack. This is a very large rack. I'm putting it together and transferring all of my gear from this Gator case. And one thing I wanted to talk about was how to rack your gear properly without uh, damaging it. Because, I mean, we're talking about thousands of dollars worth of stuff, and you, you know, you want to keep it as, as mint as possible. So, one thing I do is I put tape on the. Uh, this is just regular packing tape all along the edge of the uh, of the rack, right? And all you have to do is poke a small hole using like an X-Acto blade, and this will prevent the prevent metal on metal contact with the the back of your gear, and will save it from scratches in the long run. So uh, let me pull out a piece right here, for example, like this this patch base, easy and easy out. Um, and so there's no there's no damage here on the back of this. I don't know if you can see this in the light. Okay, there's no damage on the back of this. So you can imagine how important that is with something like a Fox box or a distressor. So the other thing that I do, there's two more things that are important when racking gear, is I always rack mount the gear uh, with the, whatever I'm racking it to mounted sideways so that the gear goes in uh, with gravity, right? And what this does is when you screw your screws in, you're not putting any pressure on the top or the bottom. So everything gets screwed in, it gets screwed in tight, and then all the pressure is distributed uh, evenly as opposed to, to fighting it. So there's no, there's no scratching on the inside of your gear. And the very last thing is I use, uh, these are the first screws that I got, and they're the Raxxus, let me see. PTSW25 rack screws with washers and these have like a like a plastic or, or, or rubber yeah it's plastic like a soft plastic washer and this pr protects the front of your gear which is probably the most important part and I have zero scratches zero marring or anything on all of my gear so those are my tips for that uh, hopefully you can save some of your gear and keep it mint for a long time all right Thanks for watching.